I think the problems start uh, in primary school and kids kids feel disenfranchised, they feel lonely, uh, they don't feel as though they have anyone to talk to, yeah. there are no kind of receptive adults, yeah. they feel alone with their fears, and um, I think a, a sort of outreach program where teens are dealing with teens makes all the sense in the world. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, who, who can talk to you like someone from your own generation? And and, and who can help you in a non-judgmental way. Mm -hmm. I think that's so much of it, isn't it? Well, and all, all these teens are dealing with the same problems that they're, you know, that they're getting from these phone calls, and they're all dealing with the same exact issues, and they're dealing from personal experience, and the people on the phones are, uh, have dealt with their friends cutting when the people on the phones are cutting, and, you know, and, and they're all you know, working out the same problems, so it's, 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 it's quite a beautiful thing when people can mm -hmm. really talk to... I mean, I, I mean, I've had personal issues like that in my past, but the one person I would really like to talk to is somebody who's dealing with them right now. Of course. You know, not being well, talked I think down we to. We all have those issues. Uh, whether or not we're, we're tremendously successful in school, sometimes you can get ostracized for all of the good reasons, too. 